Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. Uh, this is episode 59 of Shinjin Takeda campaign. Sorry about fi uh, episode 58, I forgot to plug in the microphone. I was so, <laughs> I was so excited, I didn't realize the, uh, the, the jack, uh, the plug wasn't in place. Anyway, the, the main key about, uh, episode 58 is that what uh, I believe would be a good strategy is all of these plain uh, fortresses because they have such a big uh, chunk of land or develop developable land around them uh, I will all I will I will consider all of them as potential military bases in short uh, we will be improving regardless of whether they are a fortress or a castle we will be improving their uh, balance, uh, their conscripts, maximizing their conscripts. In, in effect, we will be improving uh, their conscripts as long as at the same time we will have enough provisions to keep them going. So that's the, that's the plan. Okay, now that, uh, wait, uh, our star general is here. Uh, no, no, okay, uh... Okay, where is Shinjin, okay? We will send Shinjin ahead. It must be done. Uh, and then these guys then we can continue from here and come around to take this other one here okay who is this guy uh, Seichi we need to get him bloodied okay We will set him to come up here. Uh, these two guys, Ujiasu, will also come up here. I think we can send this guy home. No, 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 no. Let us send him here too. Yeah, because we still want to take on the uh, the Saito guys. Yeah, we'll keep this guy over here. As reserve. Okay, we can head straight for... Where's Nagoya? We're gonna head straight for Nagoya. That's right. <laughs> Did you see that? Boy, is he excited. Yes! Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we'll just... So the reason why I am doing those things, I mean creating military bases, so that let's say assuming our star general uh, has fought over here, and then, uh, well, he would have used up all his troops. So once we send him back, instead of waiting for months for the troops to recover, we can send him to another uh, military base. And then from there, he can uh, go on a campaign again. Trust of all clans. Okay, we. Begin the meeting. Reporting in. 
We have Anshok, okay. We have our, okay. Uh, there, there. 32,000, okay. All of our training has paid off. I have grown. Uh, okay, again, let's inspect the, did we pick up any castles? Oh yeah, we <laughs> we created two new castles. Mm-hmm. And again, we can use uh, even people who are not, what do you call this, are not, uh, are not uh, loyal to us at this point in time. To occupy those castles. Uh, no, these are fortresses. Uh, let's go to... Kururi has a bunch of those guys. Like this guy, we can send him there. We can go back to Kururi. Oops, Kururi. Tatayama, Tatayama. Tateyama. No, no, no. Uh, she is. No, no, not Tateyama. Uh, Kururi. Oh, to, to, okay. <laughs> to, yeah, there's a bunch of guys here. So we can use these guys. How about. Oh, red ones? No, not the red ones. Okay, now we can send uh, all the discontent guys. And uh, let's get them working for us rather than sitting here and uh, doing nothing. Right? Uh huh. Send again uh, to our newly constructed fortresses. Who's this guy? Uh, wow, he's uh, he's pretty strong. Okay, uh, and then Well for a castle this one is not F E F E E F E F F that's four hundred forty four for E four hundred sixty eight four 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 let's just might as well use four Hikuma? Yes. Oh, 172. Cool. Oh, who's the other castle that uh, 
Tamawara. Wow, this thing has a lot of uh see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So this is uh, okay. Uh, let's just make it a, a, a resource. Uh, yeah, let's make it a resource uh, town, not a military camp. Because uh, to convert it otherwise, like Iwatsuki, we have not developed any of the. Uh, Conscripts. Uh, no, 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 none of the crops. Crafts. So, E, F, uh, F, E, F. Whoa. O, E, huh? 300. Who else? Uh, Gion? Oh, Mocha. F E F E E F E F F See, all of them have good, a uh, lot of real estate surrounding them. So it just makes sense to Turn those into military uh, posts or reserve. I mean, yeah, military reserves so that we can just send our star generals or any of our strike teams to get to those place. And then all it takes is just one turn to send uh, our uh, strike teams from one place to the next. Nope. And then uh, all the little towns, they will now concentrate on, all the little fortresses will, they will concentrate on uh, development work. So that there is cohesion to the empire rather than, rather than everybody's developing uh, crafts, uh, conscripts, everything else so that you know, every town is actually mediocre, or at least our uh, military bases become mediocre in terms of size because they are not producing as much troops as possible. So we will have uh, military bases and in effect, ooh. I thought we, okay, ah, uh, yeah, we did, but uh, we have not. Uh, they have not arrived. We have assigned the people there, but they have not arrived. So the Kanto will soon be really... Uh, oh, Kawago has... 10,000 now. Okay, cool. So that uh, some cities will be, yeah, some, yeah, fortress, I'll just call them cities, right? Castles and fortresses are just, uh, they're just cities. They're, they are really cities. Uh, so some will just be concentrated as a military uh, camp and some will be, oh, how come? Oh, again, the guy is sick. So some cities will be military base, some cities will be 
production base. Food is not an issue because we have to develop the food anyway to support, even if it's a military city. So crafts would be something else. Although so far we're doing fine because uh, look at the amount of gold we are piling up. We're not hurting for gold either. So, uh, so we just need to have a a large military base because we still have to contend with the Wisugis and the Nanbu. And then of course on the left side, on the western side, look at all these guys. See? Wow. The Mori is, has almost the whole, this area locked up. And then the, and then this guy is the uh, Otobos. You have that thing locked up. So the only area of contention is just somewhere here. So this Miyoshi is weak. That's the Chokosabe. And the Kono. I think these are the Miyoshis. Yeah. And this is the Mori. Look at the Mori. Wow. And of course, Nanbu. Okay, anyway, so uh, that's it. So uh, what we're trying to do is... Okay, we will take that castle and we'll take that castle. Let's continue with the fun. <laughs> so making sure we did not miss anything. How about any goods that we did not want? buy? Nope. Okay. Welcome to <laughs> I am your foe. Okay, take the next one, Sinjin. Just next door. Okay, uh, how did they... <laughs> they just went ahead to take that one, okay. Uh, that's fine. Uh, Shinjin? Why don't you help out with this guy over here? And these two will take this one. Oh, we'll take three cities at once. Nagoya surrendered. Okay, now... We'll go after Dawson Saito after this. Wow, we've got almost half a million in rice. How many more uh, castles for... Let's check the... Uh, let's check Imagawa's. Oh, it says here four. Ah, okay. One is still standing, right? Yeah. One, two, three, four. Okay. <laughs> Three castles in a row. Now, how do we staff them again? Uh, the Nagoya, I think. Yeah, this is the this is the castle. So that is something we have to staff. 
Okay, uh, let's save this. See, now we have the tedious process of staffing. Uh, okay, the ca wow, Nagoya has 5,000 despite it's uh, being less than half. So this is, this has to at least have 12,000 soldiers in it. Now, how do we, okay, again, let us uh, look at our clan. And then let's look at the soldiers. That's the best way to do this. Uh, Tsunashige, Nobushige, Masakage, Ojiyasu. Tsunashige, Hojo, Seichi, Baba, Nagano, JR. Uh, where do we put him? Oh, in Hikuma. That guy is in Takato. Uh, Masanobu Kosaka is the Lord. Uh, uh, Koga Palace, Chacha. It's a Lord, is a Lord Odawara. Mio Takeda is in Sekiado. Mio Takeda. Toromasa Obu. Statayama. Kita Sanyara is a lord in Iwatsuki. Hmm. Niriyama, Nir, Nirayama Castle. Uh, Nirayama Castle Sanpu Yoshitaka Satomi Nirayama Castle Let's check Nirayama Castle I think it's this one The problem is, can we just leave those castles open? Tatayama? Is this Nirayama? No. How about this one? Okay, okay, okay. Uh, so who is here? Oh no, he's getting old. Yeah, that's the guy who's getting old. Okay, we can send Ota over there or no, no, no. Uh, what we want to do is, who is the Lord here? I think we have Uh, again, let <sighs> I think that lady Olin uh, Cha Cha Milo. Sekiado. So this is one of Takeda's daughters. Where is it? Sekiado is somewhere here. Yeah, and then, uh, yeah, let's send her over. Uh, and then she will be supported by, she will be supported by Ota, 
Sequiado, sequiado. Nirayama. Iwatsuki, oh, there's a lot of people in Iwatsuki. Oh, we cannot take them away because... Oh, she is also another daughter of... Right? Uh-huh. So Yukita is okay, and then... Zoshu. Uh huh. Sekiado. Wow, they're so hard to find. Moriyama. Karayama. Let's see, we're back to Iwatsuki. How about in Kiso Fukushima? Oh, they have. See, our. Okay, Sekiado. Here. And then we need to support her with, uh, who are the guys here? Do we have any guys that are, Who's this guy? Okay, so that one we can send over. And who else? Uh, yeah, and uh, okay, we can send two guys over. Uh, no, over here, Nagoya and yeah, Tsugasaki, uh, who are the guys, this guy, and this guy. Okay, and then we need to give uh, the castle, assign castle lords again. Let's go to uh, this guy is smart. Then another castle lord. Tutu <laughs> Tutu Gasat. Tutu Suji Gasaki. Okay. As soon as we send him over there, I think he will become uh Yes, he will be more loyal as soon as we send him there. Uh, this guy too. Yes, thirteen one. Okay. Uh, they will be short-handed for the meantime until uh, we get all the Imagawas under our 